it is a cold night here in Georgia, and mm. man, we are just warming up by the fire. Um, tomorrow, we actually have some plans to head down to Florida because supposedly, Hubby says it's good to buy a boat when it's cold outside. In theory. In theory. Uh, right. So I bought a motorcycle once during the winter and I got a great smoking deal. And, you know, I've heard it's just the best time to buy boats or motorcycles. Nobody's thinking about those those springtime, summertime uh, toys during the winter. So, you know, we can get a good deal. Hopefully you guys can come down and check it out. Hopefully we come back with a boat, you know. Hopefully so. You know, that's what I'm saying. <laughs> Cheers, baby. Anyway, hopefully we do. My name is Ab. I'm Irene. And this is Outlier South. So it was 14 degrees this morning, the kind of morning where I just want to lay in bed and snuggle. But we were up at like 6 a.m. and getting out of bed and getting ready because we are gonna go look at our a boat. Get the boat. Um, Ab's been <laughs> researching different kinds of boats and I think we are going to get our first boat heading down to Niceville, Florida. Um, we got, what, like another hour of driving to do? Yeah, about that. We've been searching, uh, well, I've been searching for a long time because I want to have something that's small enough for the rivers and, uh, you know, big enough to get on the, the bay or out, you know, even out a little offshore. So we'll do so much flooring. So he said the Scout Dorado 175 is a good option because it's, you know, small enough, but yet big enough. And it's, it's going to be mostly just the two of us unless we want to take out, you know, another couple or something, but, um, and our dogs. Of course, so yeah, that's it. that's what he came to, came up with out of all the researching. He's been re how long have you been researching, though? Oh, a couple months, but you know, first we I wanted a center console because they're kind of like the rage. Every that's what everybody wants, all the fishermen. And, but this is a dual console, kind of fits mm -hmm. us better. We want the comfort. Um, it's a high quality boat, but it's still small. So it's really, it really fits the bill perfect for us, foot? I think. No, it's only 17 and a half foot. 17 and a half? Yeah. Now they do have a 19 and a half foot one, but um, I tried out the 21 foot, but it was just not really good for the rivers and the little places that we want to get in, like the um, like Wikiwachi. We can take this up Wikiwachi River. Um, you know, I'm going to do a lot of expeditions in the Swanee River and, and even up Santa Fe River where you can get some skinnier water, like 10 inches deep rather than, um, you know, something that has a two foot draft or something, Right. you know. <clears throat> what kind of draft does this have? It's 10 inch draft. So, I mean, we can, we can get more shallow water. And it's just, um, it's easier to trailer all the way around. I feel like we're gonna use it more. Um, since it's kind of a Swiss army knife scenario. We've been watching videos on all the crazy stuff that happens at the boat ramps. Um, yeah, we, so we wanna we're gonna be, have to do some practicing. We don't wanna be on the chit show. <laughs> <laughs> I'll definitely have to practice. Yeah, yeah. And I'm gonna have to learn how to do some, you know, tie some ropes and stuff and help my baby out, so. You gotta do it all. <laughs> That's what our buddy Larry says. You're gonna have to teach Irene how to do stuff. I'm like, he's gonna teach himself too. Nah, I can do this boat by myself. I guess it's it's slow. All right, well, we're heading down to Niceville, Florida. Gonna go check it out. A little do it looks a little exploring too. So we got two of our dogs with us. The other two are up at home with my mama, who Show is Shuggy? doggy sitting. The back? They are. What are they doing? They're sleeping. Let's see. There's. There's Fuggies. Oh, he can't. There he is. And Shuggy. There she is. Get the boat. Gotta get Woo. the boat. Is this like a midlife crisis? No, no, no. I don't like. I don't like. I don't like midlife crisis. Not to be confused with crisis. 
Um, it's kind of weird because I've never been interested in, in having a boat because most of my buddies, family members in Georgia, they get a boat, the a bass boat, and they spend all day on the lake fishing, and it just never appealed to me. Um, it never did. It just seemed like a lot to try, you know, trailer a boat, and back and forth, cleaning the boat, the maintenance, and all that. It just seemed more of a, a problem than it was fun, but until uh, we've been renting boats on the Wikiwatsi River and riding them out to sandbars, and that just really appealed to me, just being able to see manatees on the river and all the wildlife, and then be in these sandbars seeing the dolphins and everything and just having a just a really cool time um that whole boating community and that boating lifestyle is something i feel like we could really get into so i don't have any boating experience uh, my total combined hours operating a boat in my whole life is probably like 40 hours you know renting a pontoon or something like that we do have a lot of kayaking experience we've done that for years but as far as boats no um, so this is something new. It's it's a, an adventure. It'll be really cool. So I look forward to it. Okay, we are almost to the marina. Doesn't feel like Florida. What part of Georgia are you from? Sonora. It's south of uh, Atlanta, about an hour. It's mm -hmm. right there next to Peachtree City. It's almost, uh, it's almost a sin to be this cold in Florida, right? Mm -hmm. I think she's a keeper. Spent the night here in Niceville at the True by Hilton, and breakfast was included. What you got there, babe? The world's best dog food. Shuggy's plate. What's wrong with that bagel? Mold. <laughs> Mold. <laughs> what do we got for the baby? I got Shuggy's moldy uh, bagel. It's lovely. Shuggy, here you go, baby. There you go. I know it's your favorite, baby. I got peanut butter and sausage and egg and bread and... Yeah. Uh, who plays butter? Shuggy's is. Mm-mm. Come on, Shuggy. Eat, sit. Peanut no. butter here for the baby. Okay. Hey, guys. Hi. Okay. No? No? No. Okay. Oh, he's a good boy. 
easy. <coughs> wait, wait, uh, wait, wait, sit up. Uh. Wait. Okay. okay, go ahead. Good boy. What'd you think about that? What'd you think about that, baby? Oh, he went for the peanut butter. He's gonna eat the bread. Show you he's yeah, eating. Why don't you just scarf it all down? But he likes to take his time. He likes to savor the flavors. Oh my gosh. Desperation here. It's really going to mess up your digestion. Oh, and you, oh gosh. You're going to be farting in the trough, baby. She's about to throw it up. I'll have a second. Easy. That's not going to be good on your indigestion, baby. That's a break that. Okay, Shiggy is the winner. Flavor's taking it sweet time, the baby. Shuggy, what'd you think about that, Shug? What'd you think about that? Girl, you know how I feel. You're welcome, you're welcome. Here it is, our new baby we are taking home. <sighs> Ain't she a beauty? I think Ab has a new love. The schnozberries taste like schnozberries. <laughs>